now over to Jermont Terry checking out storm preps in the south suburbs tonight. Jermont. Hey, Brad, I'm in, South, I'm in South Suburban Country Club Hills right off I-57 here at 167th Street. Now, the streets are just wet from all that rain that's been falling throughout the day and well into the night. But many people are waiting to see when it will change over and what time it will change over to snow. Nobody is more anxious than those who make money in this weather. We're talking snow plow companies. Now, over at Ron's Landscaping and Snow Plowing, the owner has pulled out the blades as he prepares for a busy night and possibly a busy 24 hours. The cargo bed is loaded with bags of salt. We caught owner Ron McDowell checking his brakes on one of his trucks. McDowell has been clearing snow in the south suburbs since the mid-80s, so he's seen his fair share of Chicago blizzards. So tonight, he's simply watching the radar. We have two trucks, and we mostly do uh, residents, and we do a little commercial. So we're just watching the radar, waiting to come down. If it come down, we're getting it. And if it comes down, when, when it comes down, as Albert is predicting, we're all going to be in it. Right now, we're just waiting to see what time this rain switches over into snow. Reporting in South Suburban Country Club Hills, Jermont Terry, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Jermont. Well, the storm is forcing the Chicago Department of Public Health to suspend its at-home vaccinations for a couple of days. Appointments will resume on Friday. Track the storm as it arrives by taking a photo of that QR code on the bottom of your screen. It will take you to the first alert weather section of our website where you can get the latest updates and check the radar anytime. And our CBS2 morning team will start 30 minutes early tomorrow to help you navigate your commute. Join us anytime after 4 a.m. here on CBS2 and our digital streaming network, CBS News Chicago, which you can find online or on our app.